So, my COVID test came back and it's positive and I'm not gonna say that so tired of things keep happening and I just want for once things to go well I knew the test was gonna be positive because the last two days I started losing my taste my cold it seemed to go down but it's not and see, my nose is better my throat is still hurting and yeah when i started drinking two days ago peppermint tea i couldn't feel the peppermint and then yesterday i was having roast potatoes couldn't feel the, the taste of it and then i had nutella chocolate i couldn't feel the taste of it i still feeling salt and sweet anyway the test says i have to self-isolate for 10 days and um, I had this. I was in close contact with someone from. With someone. Like from the third or fourth of January, so it's been already like ten days. But anyway, I'll talk to my midwife to see if I can see her on Tuesday, if it's possible, because I'm not sure if I'm still contagious. And. Yeah, anyway, it could have been worse because my symptoms are not really, really big, but I can feel the baby is <laughs> not <It's> happening. <sighs> okay, I'll try to eat more vitamin C and D and that's it. So I've done the pink grapefruit, that's my vitamin C, I'm gonna be drinking milk as well for vitamin D, calcium and I have my cup of tea and I have my tablet, pregnancy tablet as well. So yeah, I will keep you posted of how my situation it is and hopefully it doesn't get worse and I want you to see uh what are the symptoms what's what's happening i want other pregnant women who actually escaped from this virus i want them to watch this video so they don't get that scared from it they just keep calm and protect their baby